Stay away from your past. Stay away from past relationships. Stay away from past friendships. Stay away from the past pains, the struggles. Anything that kept you being that old version of yourself, man, stay away from it, please. In 2025, let's stay away from the old things, man. Remember, anything that might pull you back to become that old person that you worked so hard to move forward from, let it go, man. It's crucial. It's crucial. It's crucial. It's crucial to preserve yourself. Look, we have to avoid regression at all costs. Reconnecting with the past, past people, past environments, past trauma, anything like that can bring you back into unhealthy patterns. Remember that. It can bring you back to unhealthy patterns that you work so hard to overcome. I know you put in that work to overcome it. Guess what? The work is not done yet because now it's time to let go and continue on your walk. Continue on your journey alone without those people. So look, old friends, old relationships, anybody from your past that may trigger familiar dynamics, look, let them go. Dynamics such as hindering you from being that great person that you just worked so hard to become. Let it go, man. Please, let it go. Let it go. And if you agree with me, man, look. Like the video. Give me a subscribe. Turn your notification bell on. If you agree with anything I'm saying, just drop it down in the comment and let me know that you understand what I'm saying and you agree with what I'm saying. Let's be stable emotionally look it's hard it's really really hard out here being emotional stable but guess what sometimes you just have to be that way someone has to be that way someone has to be that person why not you let's not revisit old relationships that can reopen emotional wounds that we've healed that we've healed or you got conflicts in the past with someone that you haven't resolved. Let that go. Let that person go. Keep moving. Keep pushing. Keep being you. Keep being great. It's okay, man. Don't leave yourself to be vulnerable. Don't leave yourself to be vulnerable. Look, protect your boundaries. Protect your peace. You work so hard to create this boundary, create these boundaries for yourself. Put a wall up that man. Now it's time to protect it, man. Protect that wall. Healthy boundaries, man, it's essential for growth. And past relationship, it's essential. Without boundaries, we have nothing because we just get ran over. Like, we gotta have a wall. We have to. That's the only way we can live our life with dignity. We gotta have a wall. So don't re-engage with those people, man, because it can just make it hard to maintain your boundary. So protect their space, protect their values, protect their goals. Guess what? When you cut ties with someone that reopens wounds, man, look, you reclaim control over that energy that you had that was not good. So Guess what? That's why we got to keep the boundaries up so we can keep that positive energy going. Look, man, we got to subscribe, man. Look, baby, we almost at our goal. Subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Like the video, baby. Look, we talking some real stuff right here. And we're going to talk some more real stuff pretty soon. I know a lot of y'all been rocking with me. Thank y'all. Thank y'all for rocking with me, baby. Keep rocking with me. We got so much more coming. So much more coming. Speaking of so much more coming, we got a video about this next point. Guess what? Shift your mindset. If you want to cut ties from people from your past, you got to shift your mindset. You got to no longer think about them for one. Then you got to just give yourself that grace and give yourself that acknowledgement that you've outgrown those people and that's okay like you've outgrown those people you're no you no longer serve those people any purpose in their life remember that behaviors that was a part of your past relationships that you've outgrown it's okay to walk away with that because guess what interacting with those past it might pull you back into that old way of thinking that old negative version of yourself. The one that never thought anything was possible. The one that never believed. 
because other people was in your ear telling you what you can't do or how no one else has done it. That person, look, stay away from it. Stay away from it. Break free from your comfort zone. Look, it may be comfortable talking back to that person because that's all you know. It's okay. That's not all you're going to know. I promise. Just keep going. Keep pushing. And you will know more people. I promise. It's going to be somebody, if not better, similar. I promise. Keep going. That goes from anybody, anybody, friends, family, relationship. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Get out of your comfort zone. Get out of your comfort zone. Protect your self-worth. That's why I said have your boundaries open, man. Don't re-enter toxic relationships because now you diminish your worth. Don't do that. Don't diminish your self-respect. That's what you work so hard to build. Don't diminish that. Because once you lose that, man, it's hard building that back up. It's hard getting somebody else to respect you once you diminish your own values and once you bend on your own boundaries. Don't bend on your own boundaries. Respect yourself. By any means, respect yourself, man. Because guess what? If the dynamics are one-sided or unhealthy, man, by staying away from it, you protect your sense of value. That's what you protect. Your sense of value and the healthy image that you work for on yourself. That healthy self-image, you protect that. So guess what? Keep it going. Keep it going. I know somebody may come up to you and say, hey, man, we got to finish business. I know the breezy may come up to you. Hey, man, we got to finish business. Ladies, I know the man may come up to you. We got to finish business, man. You were supposed to be this. You were supposed to be that. We were supposed to do this. If we were supposed to do it, it would have happened. It then, That chapter of my life is closed. Keep it pushing. That's okay. It's okay to keep it pushing. Just keep it pushing. That chapter of my life is closed. That chapter of my life is closed. Look, while closure is important, just remember, trying to resolve the past so much, it can sometimes be more reliving the past than anything. So just keep that in mind because you're really not healing. you really just revisiting old wounds sometimes honestly so just move on do the internal work it's going to take some time and that's okay sometimes you will never understand it no matter how hard you try you will never understand it so don't beat yourself up trying to understand it don't do that don't do that don't do that avoid the temptation to reopen chapters that you already closed man y'all gotta give me some likes man Give me a thumb up on this, man. We got to we gotta spread this knowledge to everybody, man. Y'all subscribe, share this video if you haven't done so already. We got to keep spreading this love. We got to keep, keep spreading this love, man. Look, get ready to create space for new connections. When you cut ties with the past, you open up room for the better, for healthier, for new, and more fulfilling relationships in your life that serve you a purpose. That's what you open the door for, man. That's what you open the door for in ways that no one else in the past got you to. That's what you open the doors up for. That's what you create a new space for, man. Keep that in mind. This is just a positive for moving scale, moving social circle for yourself. And that's leading us into the final one emotional independence you got yourself man you don't need anyone to help you stay happy you have that self happiness trait within yourself man you do not need anyone to help you stay happy think about that when you move away from the old ties man you encourage yourself to build a stronger connection with you a stronger independence connections you learn to rely on your own emotional resilience because you have no one else to rely on and then you strengthen yourself rather than seeking validation from others you don't always need reassurance you are the reassurance keep being great man look 
Just keep distancing yourself from the past. Past influences help you create a space where you can evolve without the weight of past limitations, man. Remember that. Or the temptations. Look, family, you made it this far. Again, like the video. Drop a comment. Share, man. See y'all next time, baby. I'm out.